Today's discussion is postponed, as we have a very special guest. He's played an instrumental part in the world debut of the IBM PC, which is now on the verge of becoming the industry standard for corporate America. Please welcome Mr. Joseph McMillan. Let me start by asking a question. How many of you desire to be computer engineers? Hmm. Oh, glad you could join us. Keep your hands up, keep your hands up. Now I'm going to list off several categories. When you hear a category you don't have hands-on experience in, put your hand down. Software design, hardware software integration, circuit design, microprocessing, firmware design, very large scale integration. Ah, something funny? I don't think you really know what that is. Why? Because nobody who knows what it is calls it that. VLSI. How's that? Operating systems. PROM configuration and PLC design. Personal computer design. Very good. Now tell me one thing that will be true about computers 10 years from now. Well, fully intelligent machines will simulate the actions of neurons more closely um, and replicate. Okay, thanks. You. Uh, computers will be connected together across one network with a standard protocol. Like phone lines? Obviously, phone lines. What's your name? Cameron. Cameron Howe. This is you. Oh, awesome. Thanks. You'll pay for it. Do you want to tell me what you're doing? Uh, writing bios for a machine no one's going to give a shit about. <laughs> ah, you're right. You're right. Who cares about the machine? What really matters are the people who will use it. If we lower the cost, we lower their barrier to entry. And by doubling the speed, we allow them to do twice as much. So now, we've got twice as many people using our computer for twice as long. Wow. Can you practice that in a mirror? Look, I don't think you appreciate the opportunity we have here. Mm. To... I heard all about it. Have fun, make money. And then a whole bunch of other shit that you either made up entirely or stole from someone else. You're just a salesman. We're looking for evidence of hacking. Computer crime. Osworth couldn't do that. He knows maybe three people who could. Are you a part of this? Osworth came to me. Okay, he asked if I knew about the 414s, about hacking, and it was so easy. They were practically, like, the bank has no security whatsoever. I'm sorry. We were gonna put all the money back in Cardiff's account as soon as we made some sales and we came back from Comdex. I mean, we thought he'd never notice. Everybody out. Hey, where are you with that module? Are you kidding me? What? Gordon, we tasked this all with drivers. You keep changing directions on us. This sucks. Just figure out what you want us to do and we'll do it. Jesus. Get all the coders in my office. Now. I don't know what anyone else has told you, but I'm your manager. You take instructions from me, okay? That's what everyone else is saying. Well, they're wrong, okay? 
I need that module for the OS and I need it today. Any questions? Yeah, I got a question. Are you banging Joe McMillan? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm stupid for thinking a toy store might carry the world's most popular toy. Hello? Debbie! Any luck? Not yet! Uh, yes, I'm looking for a, a, a cabbage patch kid. You do? Uh, uh, really? Um, uh, uh, can, can you put it on hold? No, I will come right now. Look, do not sell that cabbage patch. Hello? Gordon. What? You were incredible last night. I, I would never, okay? You, you guys know Donna, right? I don't know. She's light years ahead of where I was then. She is tomorrow, and we're all better off because of it. In the end, it doesn't matter what design we choose because it's what's inside the machine that's brilliant. She did that. <laughs> Not you. Just Not me. Stop. Do the case. Don't do the case. I don't care. Sorry. That guy just messes me up. how the booth looks. Is anyone coming? I would. Where the hell have you been? It's past 11.30. Nice of you to show up. Come here, you're gonna wanna see this. None of them showed up for work today. Where are they? Neil, tell them. Uh, they all went to work for mutiny. Yeah, I've never heard of it. <laughs> well, that's the best part. Okay. I need you guys to buy as many XT to the shelves as you can until these max out. Okay, okay, but the modem firmware's like bugging out all over the place. Okay. You need to get on the protocols, the interface, the games. Okay. You also have someone dedicated to hardware. Shit. Preferably an adult. Okay. 